hi this is Philip again in this video I will going to provide you a short overview that what makes our site are essentially aligned with the different vital core inside without any further delay let's go ahead and analyze this existing site that I uploaded in a Netlify server so let's go to with the Google PeedSpeed insight analyzer so I'm gonna copy paste my URL for the wave app and we're gonna wait for a maybe probably two minutes and we it will bring the result so most commonly what happiness in our old native Shufify team since that those teams are a client side rendering and now the hydrogen apps it's provided us a server side rendering that's much more advantages than rather than a client side rendering now we're gonna evaluate what makes the score are putting us into a green light like in the performance we have 92 98 100 an SEO for the mobile if we try to look at what are those things has been flagged so I, di I did not see anything now because I think everything was passed to this audits result like I think we reach up to 35 uh, past audits but still there's still uh, some diagnostic report and you're gonna see here I think there are only few things that uh, I have to fix but since I was already in a uh, green light and then I think I am ready to inject any third party script so mostly if somebody will join to your team like for example a marketing people what will be the tools that they are going to integrate with your store because as what we commonly known that this marketing strategy is to inject their purposes to make them visible to their end like for example a Google Analytic or probably let me say uh, what else like a pixel uh, Facebook pixel or probably a hot jar to analyze the the experience of your uh, customers and visiting to your site and then what the cost and probably will take down your score so right now we have 92 and now I will going to demonstrate you how we are going to inject this Google Analytics to the apps the hydrogen apps so we're gonna see here it is 92 now there's another uh, analyzer that also provide a different way how to evaluate your site performance it is on the gtmetrics.com so we're gonna try this again in the gtmetrics.com how it is performing and we will see those uh, issues that we found if when your site are too low on the score result let's just wait in a little bit a minute and then we will see the result now it's it is in a passing grade so I think we still have to improve a little bit with this but now I just want to you to learn how uh, affected to the score if we're going to inject the Google Analytic report okay so we go ahead and insert this script for Google Analytic and then what we need to do here just wait for a second okay so install manually now the instruction here 
is to copy paste this code in every page of your website immediately after head and then we are using a uh, react then react is a single page framework then we're gonna only inject it in one file so in hydrogen app we have this index.html and we're gonna add that script here that's it okay we're gonna save now I already integrate this repository to the Netlify server for Hydrogen. So once I going to update this changes on my repository, then it will also automatically update on the Netlify server. Updates added uh, Google GA Google Analytics. Then get push origin mean all right and then we just wait for a few maybe around two minutes then it will automatically apply those changes and we go are going to analyze it again how it will differ your score performance on your mobile and uh, probably in the desktop and i think in the desktop it doesn't really a big deal but mostly in the mobile problem because what happened is most of the lead that brought from a marketing team are always uh, coming from the mobile uh, sessions I mean most of your customer using the mobile devices and they make their orders through their mobile rather than desktop so that's the the, f the thing that we need to consider why is it really important that we have to comply that our web apps will be uh, performing well before we are going to inject other script and then in Shopify old teams we can easily add a third party script like an apps if you if you have something to add a uh, unique functionality that you cannot find in your team then you need to install a third party apps then that would be also added a different score on your mobile performance so now I think we're gonna try it again so analyze that so hopefully it will not take much longer so we're gonna wait for a few minutes and mostly it will only affect on the pitch speed uh, insight for Google but in the GT matrix I think this will be alright so there are different purposes between these two sites and in the pitch speed Google uh, sorry in the pitch speed Google analyzer they doesn't provide a waterfall but in the GT matrix you will see here what exactly this script are doing like how long it takes this script to complete loaded to the client and what are the script are being rendered and what's the size of the the script or images or video or whatever files it's been added to your site okay so that's it then let's go back here if you see here it's going down to 86 it means from 91 score earlier it went down as much as 5 so it's not really a big uh, amount of value but I think if we're gonna add more third party script to your site then it will take a l more va uh, score on your mobile performance but we're gonna check in the desktop I think this stuff it not really feel uh, compare on the mobile so I think that's the one thing that you must consider that what makes our site really important to in line with the vital core insight and if you choose the hydrogen 
then that would be the most significant move because this is the the framework that was released last few months ago last year and I think it has not really tested yet but in my opinion it is a game changer of the Shopify store I think hoping that you learn something with this video and wait for my next video release and it is regarding about the collection filter thank you for watching and see you in my next video bye for now